at home, this is the moment that a state trooper may have saved many lives on the Sunshine Skyway Bridge. Investigators say she deliberately put her SUV in the path of a drunk driver who was barreling toward runners in the Skyway 10K yesterday morning. Trooper Tony Shuck is now recovering at home tonight while the woman who crashed into her sits in jail. Fox 13's Kimberly Cuisan spoke with one of the trooper's colleagues. Within seconds and no time to pause, Florida Highway Patrol Trooper Tony Shuck made a split-second decision, placing herself directly in harm's way. <laughs> Using herself and her SUV as a barrier to protect runners in the Skyway 10K. There was no time to think. You have to act. And without question, she was the last line of defense. Behind the wheel of the BMW was 52-year-old Kristen Watts of Sarasota. Trooper Ken Watson said she blew past road closures and law enforcement. As Watts got closer to the bridge, another trooper got into position trying to stop her. Ultimately, Trooper Shuck veered her SUV into her path. There's no telling what would have happened had that vehicle actually reached all of those runners. Uh, you know, the bottom line is these troopers saved dozens upon dozens of lives. Watts was wheeled into the Manatee County Jail Monday afternoon. Now I need a defender. <laughs> As she made her first appearance, she told a judge she has no job and is living off money from a lawsuit. As she faces multiple charges, including driving under the influence, she laughed. Would you have any trouble coming to court? Well, considering I don't have a car. <laughs> Trooper Shunk is back home, resting with her family and recovering from a head wound and concussion. With 26 years as a trooper, her instincts went above the call of a hero. For this trooper to risk her life to make sure that others would be okay is the epitome of what service is all about. Watts remains in the Manatee County Jail on a $52,000 bond, and the word hero truly is not enough to describe Trooper Shuck's actions. And if you would like to thank her, you can do so by sending either a card or well wishes to FHP's Troop C office. From the Skyway, Kimberly Cuisan, Fox 13 News.